Hi and welcome to iMovie Basics tutorial number 10. All right, in this one what we're going to learn about is this thing called titles and credits. Um, all right, so if you want to add text over some stuff, um, you can totally do that. Where you need to be at right now is you need to have all this footage. You need to have your first video, these three pictures of your favorite movies, add transitions to each one of these, um, and also these need to be changed two four seconds three seconds that kind of stuff so if you don't have know how to do that go back to the other videos and you can get to where we're at right now all right so here we go um we, there's two ways you can add titles or two different ways you can see titles you can actually put it over a clip or over a picture or you can have it just be a standalone first one i'm going to do is i'm going to show you how to put something over the top like an overlay all right so i'm going to just choose this one if you same with the other stuff if you just here's the text button so click that first um, if you go over something it will kind of give you a little preview of how things look I'm gonna choose this one right here um, and I'm just gonna take it and drag it on top um, if, I, if I do like this and you see the little green line again that means that it's gonna go before that or after it but if I go over the top of it it'll overlay it so now it's on top of my video alright so over here I'm just gonna put top three favorites favorite movies um, and then when I'm done I can just press done but I want to actually mess with the font so I can you press the show fonts up there and you can go through and check to see what these different will look like on here um, if you don't like these, these are just like the preset. You can set these up of which ones actually show up here. Um, you got your bold and all those kind of things. Um, but down here, there has system font panel. That will bring up all the fonts that are actually on your computer, and you get a little bit more um, options of what your text is going to look like. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm just going to basically keep the one that they already have. Let's go back to this guy. Um... I'm just gonna keep. Th I'm just gonna go this guy, and then be done. All right. So if I want to preview it, I can press this button. All right. So when I do this, it's only one second long. So when I play this, okay, I couldn't read that at all. So what you can do is here's your text up here. Um, I'm gonna select that text just by clicking it. And now I can take it and I can drag it different places. Um, I'm gonna have. I want it to start before, like right when that kind of opens up. Um, and then I can also go to the edge of it, click and drag it, as long as I want this thing to show up. Um, it'll change the duration. Like this has an animation, so it will uh, change how long it actually lasts. So if we play this again, now it's at two minutes. Or I'm sorry, two seconds, a little over two seconds. So let's see how that looks now. All right, I can kind of still read that, but I want it even a little bit longer. Let's see. Top three favorite. All right, perfect. All right, so I added that one. Now I'm going to add one more transition here at the end just to do like a made by me kind of thing. Um, let's see. I like this horizontal blur. I'm just going to add that at the end. And now it's just, this thing shows up. It has a little background. So these are the different backgrounds that you can choose. Um, I'm just going to choose industrial. And then I'm going to put my text in here. If I just click in here, I can change it. Made by. I'm just going to put my name here. Or you can put producer, you can put whatever you want, it doesn't matter. Um, I'm just going to press done. So now in this ends, the end here, my last transition, goes right into that. And then it's over. Um, so your assignment is to add two different types of text or titles. You're going to have one that does an overlay, and you're going to do another one 
that is just an all alone by itself thing. Now, if you want to change this background, you've already, if you've already done it, all you gotta do is just click it, double click it, and you got this background here, the inspector, and you can go back in and change it to something else if you want something else. But I'm just gonna keep my industrial, and then press done. Um, so, thanks. <laughs>